Hey, what is up guys? Welcome back to my channel. My name is Rake and welcome to episode 5 of the 1.17.1 Let's Play series. So in the last episode, as you guys remember, or if you haven't actually seen the episode, we actually built this little bridge here and also the little one down there. Uh, it was actually a pretty hard build to do, but I think it turned out pretty well. I'm very pleased with it. And we also did rename our axolotl down here because Squishy Joe is in this world. There he is. He's swimming about in that little pond down there. And also, we'll have to rename the other axolotl here. And uh, you guys did leave me a few name suggestions for it. It's the yellow axolotl, just in case you guys have forgotten. But yeah, in this episode, we're going to need to try and get a enchanting setup. Because uh, I kind of want to get some enchants going. Because we do have 32 levels, as you can tell. Oh, and also, yep, yeah, I did bring my wheat. Good. We're going to actually breed up our cows a bit. We're getting quite a few cows in here. It's looking really good. Uh, we've only got 20 wheat though. I, I think we've got more than 20 cows in yet. Excuse me. I'm coming through. Here's some wheat, everybody. There we go. There we go. Three more bits of wheat. One more. Anyone else? There we go. All right. That was a bit laggy there. <laughs> right, let me grab all the XP quickly. There we go. Good. Oh, there's those eggs as well. We should maybe make a cake at one point. <laughs> but anyway, alright, so we're going to need to get some stuff ready. The thing is, we don't have enough sugarcane right now. I've only got like 39 sugarcane. I don't know how much I need exactly to make enough books, but I think we do have enough leather. We do have 37 leather. But anyway, uh, we're going to get some uh, resources ready here. And also, I'm going to mine out a nice big area inside here. Oops, inside here, and uh, we need a little area for the enchanting setup, so I'll probably do it like in the back corner there. And then over here on this side, we'll have like a way up to go up there. I think that's a good idea. Alright, so anyway, let's go skip the night, and then uh, we'll get building. Alright, so we got a little area here all polished down, or all cleared out, I should say. So we're going to start with some pillars here. There we go. Go up kind of want to strip these I think so let's strip those there we go and in here we're going to have our enchanting room so for now like I don't have any bookshelves I'm just going to use this so that will be where the table is oh we so we need to remove one more layer of the wall here uh, we're gonna to have to place some bookshelves in the corners as well just so we can try to get to level 30 uh, it shouldn't take too long because I have planted a bunch more sugar cane down there so we should be able to get this enchant and set up pretty soon we will be doing an enchant uh, before the end of the episode that is for sure as well so we'll do that there we go uh, do that then that and that maybe I think that might be enough Alright, so from here we're going to do so like that, a little archway. Uh, should we have another beam going across? Let's see. So go across like that. Uh, for now that I do, grab some trapdoors. I think we can make this look a little bit nicer. There we go. What does that look like? Uh, actually I don't like that. Let's remove that quickly. Grab some slabs I think might look a little bit nicer. Or not. <laughs> uh, maybe upside down step. Let's give that a try. There we go. Alright, it makes a bit more of an archway here. So I'm a bit more pleased with that. So from here, what we can do on the inside. It's going to be a little bit hard on the inside, I think. Um, so we can do that. Do the same on this side. We can have some pillars going there. There we go. Here we can have... Like a little shelving unit, I guess. Like we can put those little stuff there. Maybe some barrels as well for some storage. Like we can put our lapis in there. What else can we add? We need like a little light up here. Actually, no, we could probably just hang it from the ceiling here. Hmm. How should we do this? Let's do some slabs all the way across. Go there and there. Break that. Now we'll replace this with a block. I'm going to actually do a log, I think. There we go. I don't have a lantern on me though. All right, we'll have to get a lantern and we'll place that up there. Yeah, so on here, I kind of want to probably break this. We could probably use some bricks behind here. It might look a little bit nicer. I don't have any bricks on me. Dang it. All right, let me, get, let me go get some bricks quickly and I'll be right back. I might have had a better idea, guys. I think what we're going to do actually is make a little aquarium for our other axolotl. Because I think it'll look really cool whilst we're like enchanting in here. We'll see an axolotl just swim around. Right, let's just make a little bit of room, not too much, because I don't. I want to actually be able to see it, and it doesn't like go in a corner and never, and we never see it ever again. So there we go. That'll do for now. 
What we could do is add, uh, I don't know, a bit of dirt in here maybe. There we go, a bit of dirt there. Let's grab some dirt. All right, place that there. There we go. Uh, we're gonna need some lighting in here, so probably I'm gonna do like a torch. There we go. Got, I've got no more inventory space. Do the same over here. Go too deep. There we go. Grab our glass. Place that there. All right, that, that's cobblestone is going to despawn. <laughs> but yeah, I think yeah. Then we could have like some windows here, and I think they look really cool. We might actually, I might actually use panes instead of glass blocks. Um. All right, let me go get some water. We're going to need a bunch of water to put in there, and we'll also have to rename the XLR before putting it in. So I need some bone meal as well, so that we can actually grow some seagrass in there. And then, yeah, I think that look really cool. Okay, so I've got a bit of water here. Um, all right, this is going to be a mess. Let me just do this quickly. There we go. That should do the trick. All right, uh, water. Some there. Some of it there. There we go. Go all the way across and to there. Okay. Now, come. What's the glass going to look like here? So. All right, I think it. I think it won't look too bad. Okay, so like that. Uh, I'm not going to put the axolotl in yet though, because we need to get some bookshelves. I think I might actually try to craft up a few bookshelves quickly, just so we can actually build the actual aquarium. Uh, for now though, what we can do is. Hmm. All right. Actually, no. Let's let's grab. Did I drop my? No, I didn't. All right. I thought I dropped my things. Let's actually make this a little bit higher here. There we go. There you go. All right. So that's the water sources now. We can bone meal some of this. There we go. And there. All right. That looks good. Yeah, I'm pleased with that. Okay. So now, yeah, I'm going to go and make uh, three bookshelves, actually, or as many as I can. And I'm going to replace this cobble here with some bookshelves so we can actually close it off and then put our axolotl in there. Okay. And also, guys, I did choose a name from, uh, like, a few episodes ago. And I think I'm going to go with Waffle. I really do like that name. So, Waffle, there you go. It's the yellow axolotl, if you guys have forgotten. There we go. Look at him. There we go. <laughs> All right, so we're going to bring Waffle into the new aquarium. Oh, and we need to make our bookshelves as well. So let's grab that. There we go. Turn all of this into paper. Perfect. Where is our leather? There we go. Actually, we need to make a bit of room. So let me put some of this away. There we go. Don't need all that. There we go. All right, so now where is it? There we go. Leather there. Paper here. It's a few bookshelves already. All right, let's craft all of these books into bookshelves. So that's four bookshelves. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> We're quite far off, unfortunately. We're going to need a bunch more paper. Uh, hopefully it is growing. It should be growing down here. This is where I placed it. Where is it? There it is. All right. So it is growing. All right. Good. We've got a bunch of cows. So I doubt we're going to run out of leather. I've been breeding them up for a while now. But right now, let's get some bookshelves. There we go. Come in here. Break that and that. I didn't mean to break whatever I just broke. Place that there. There we go, and oh, uh, this is a bit of a problem. How many books do I have? One. All right. Um. Okay, butters, you better not escape on me, okay? So I'll do that. Let me get a glass pane ready. There we go. Ah, oh, I got a fall. Oh, there we go. How's that looking? All right, that's good. Yeah, that is really good. I'm pleased with that. Then we've got butters, just uh, butters. I keep saying butters. I was meant to say waffles. I was really debating on which name to choose. So waffle is going to be swimming around like that. <laughs> Butter. I keep messing up my bad. Waffles. But yeah, waffle is just swimming around. So we'll be enchanting. And I think that's really cool. Look at that. I really like that. I'm really pleased. We can even maybe extend it onto this side. Can we? Yeah, we kind of can. Yeah, we kind of can. All right, but for now, yeah, I want to get some bricks probably laid into this wall here just for a bit more decoration. There we go. So let's get rid of all of this stone just like that. We can actually swap our glass pane as well. We don't need that anymore. Uh, there we go. Oh, I don't want to put logs there either. Okay, so put some stone bricks. There we go. Okay, that looks nice. Um, anything else over here? So I think we're going to do the same here. We can maybe even add like a little hole where we can put like a little plant pot or something. I think that'll look nice. So we'll do that. So like that, there we go, and then we have like a little plant pot area here. Hmm. Yeah, I think that look nice. I think that look nice. So let's add a bit more color though. So do that, and then there we go. I think we can do the same on this side. There we go. 
place that and strip it. Yeah, I'm liking how this is turning out. This is uh, looking really nice. Get rid of this as well. Yeah, I'm really pleased with this. Uh, we did bring the lantern with us as well, so we can place that now. There we go. Yeah, looking good. This is this is really looking good. All right, so let me just get rid of that. There we go. Okay. So yeah, we need to just farm up a few more sugar cane and so we can get some more bookshelves going. And then once we've done that, we can place uh, all the bookshelves in here and we can start enchanting. But for now though, I need to figure out how we want to get up here. I think what we can do is just a staircase. I think we're going to do like a staircase here. And here I, I wanted to actually make like a um, little armor station where we place all the armor stands uh, with like some armor. I wanted to put um, iron armor one, a diamond armor one and a full netherite armor one. I think that would look really cool. Uh, so yeah, um, let's try that. So we need to make a bit more room again because I need three spots. So I was going to do like one here, one here and one here. Let me just mark that out quickly. Uh, I don't have any more stone bricks. There we go. And there. All right. So yeah, we're gonna place all of these here. So I need another. Need to dig another three blocks deep that way. All right. So let's try to do that. Okay. So I've been standing here now for a little bit. I'm trying to figure out how to make this look nice. So we're gonna have armor stand there. Oh, no, not there. Sorry, right there. But here, what should we do? Like a pillar like that. Then, oh, not like that. But I was gonna say we do the same on this side. There we go. Put an upside down set there. So here, I guess we could have like the netherite one. So we could have like iron, diamond, and netherite right in the center. I think that would look nice. The only thing is, it's not really centered. Uh, maybe if we do that, it might look a little bit nicer. So if I get rid of this, it'll give a bit more uh, open space, I'm hoping. Hoping it'll look nicer. The thing is, I don't want to go too far that way because, yeah, we're pretty close to the end here, as you can tell. Yeah, very close. Okay. So here we walk in. We can actually get rid of this. I think this is in the way. So we walk in like that. Yeah, I think that'll look nice. And then we'll come over here. And here we have a staircase going up. I think that could be nice. All right, let's get rid of this. Uh, what I can do, though, we're going to add some oak into here. There we go. Get rid of that. 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 And that. There we go. Uh, what about this side? Yeah, we need to do the same here. So get rid of this. Break that as well. And these two blocks here. All right, where is our oak? There we go. Got too much stuff again in my inventory. There we go. Now strip it. Yeah, I'm liking that. I'm liking that. It looks a bit. It looks uh, quite nice actually. There we go. Now strip it again. Okay, and on the sides here, I was thinking on putting some trapdoors. There we go. I really hope one day they will actually give us some. Um, slabs that you can put on the walls like this. I think that looks so cool. Uh, one up there as well. There we go. Yeah, I'm liking that. I'm liking that. Uh, what about in here? Should we do oak planks instead? Yeah, it gives a bit more texture to the build, I think. I'm, I'm really pleased with that. Yeah, now we need to figure out how we're going to include a bit more detail. This roof is uh, way too flat for one, so we're going to have to bring that up a little bit. There we go. Let me get rid of all of this. Let me try to get a nice roof set up, guys. I have no idea how I'm going to do this. Well, not a roof. I mean a, I mean a ceiling. Hopefully, we can make this look nice. <laughs> I'm really hoping we can. All right. So, guys, I am not going to lie. I have been struggling so much right now to build this little um, room. Uh, it was very, very hard because none of it is uh, lining up because it's like a very weird angle. So, the roof looks a bit weird. <laughs> I've tried to add like a little pillar here. Hopefully it doesn't look too bad. Once we get some lighting in here, it should look a little bit nicer. I was thinking of putting like a lantern there and a lantern there. Uh, maybe, I don't know. <laughs> like, like, as you can tell, see, nothing lines up. So I tried to make some little design like with some stairs here, then some slabs. Here we'll have the way up to the next floor. Uh, I kind of like this little archway, actually. And in here, I've changed the floor as well. So we have a wood floor in this one. We'll have our little... Maybe we can put, oh, what could we put in here? I was thinking like a, we could put a plant pot. I don't know, maybe a lantern here as well as decoration. Let's do that. There we go. So we've got a lantern there. We'll have a plant pot there. And then in here will be all our enchanting. So where is Waffle? You're there. Hey, right, Waffle, look at you. <laughs> I was scared for a second. I thought he left. But anyway, yeah, we need to add a bit more lighting in here. But that'll be good. So here we'll have armor stand one. Then one here and one here. So yeah, I'm pretty pleased with it. It's not too bad in my opinion. Uh, it's just a bit messy because of the roof. But yeah, apart from that, yeah, I'm pretty pleased with it. Oh, and I'm missing a stone brick. Do I want to meet? 
I do not. Okay, well, I'll have to... I need to make a stone cutter. It'd be a lot easier to bring, but I think we do have one, actually. I already made one, didn't I? Well, anyway, uh, I'll swap this out for a stone brick, and I think what we can do now, actually, I kind of want to go to the nether. I want to see if we got a good nether spawn. So I might make myself a diamond pickaxe, and I think there's a lava pool not too far, actually. Just, yeah, just down there. So, uh, so we could use that, actually, to make a nether portal. Because um, I've got nowhere where I really want to put it right now. But uh, later on we will be building a nether portal room. But for now, yeah. I'm just going to place a random nether portal somewhere. And then uh, we're going to go to nether. Alright, here we go. Our first diamond pickaxe. Woohoo! Finally! We got a diamond pickaxe. Look at that. That's awesome. Alright. Uh, what we're going to go do now is... I need to go grab some water actually. So we're going to jump down where our sugar cane is. So I can actually collect that as well. And then we're going to go to that lava pool. Hopefully it won't take forever, which it will, because I know I hate mining obsidian. I don't know about you guys, but I've got a feeling I'm not the only one out there that hates mining obsidian with a normal pickaxe and not enchanting, like with no efficiency. Oh, there we go. Grab all of that, because it's so annoying to, to farm. Anyway, let me get all of this. There we go. Oh, and that one. All right, let's go get that obsidian, and then we're just going to place a random portal somewhere. Just for now, and then uh, we'll go to the nether and hope that we get a good spawn. I haven't got like a fortress spawn in a while, like very close to a fortress. So I'm hoping that we can get one. Every time I do a world now, the nether is uh, always a pain. It's like my 100 day video that I made recently. Well, I'm still making, I mean. Uh, my nether spawn was not the best. The portal was quite far away. So let's hope we get a good spawn. Okay, so we got our obsidian. Oh, and I just realized I don't have a flint and steel on me. No. All right, well, let's uh, go get a flint and steel quickly. And I'm going to just place it like probably like, over there somewhere, I think. Oh, just because I don't want to hear the sound of the portal 24-7. So, yeah, let me grab some flint and we'll try to make a flint and steel. I hope we've got some flint. I don't think I've seen any. We should have some somewhere. I hope anyway. All right, there might be some on the chest upstairs, but I'm also going to put away the pickaxe because we don't need that right now. And I do remember, yeah, there we go. We have some gold, so we're going to bring that with us. There we go. And hope to get some trades going because uh, we need some ender pearls. I kind of want to do the ender dragon as soon as possible. Uh, there we go. Because I haven't even done a ender dragon fight in a let's play yet. <laughs> so hopefully we can do one now. Oh, there's some flint. There we go. Perfect. And there we go. There we have it. I should have probably bought some cobblestone, but YOLO, we don't need cobblestone. Oh, well, I hope we don't. <laughs> I hope there's no glass that's going to just shoot at our portal. Oh. Oh, no. Okay, no, we have a uh, prison, Crimson Forest, I think it's called. But I hate this place so much. The, uh, what is it called, this biome? Oh, I forgot what it was called. Um, Alright, let's uh, look around here. Hopefully we can find like a normal biome pretty close by. Well, we do have the crimson one, which is good. So we can get a bunch of enderpearls from there pretty easily. But anything else around here? All right, not that way. We're not going that way. Oh, actually, it looks like there might be some normal never wastes over there. So that's good. All right, well, let's go check out the crimson forest quickly. Hopefully we don't die. That is the biggest uh, worry right now. I really don't want to die. Uh, actually, I think I might go home quickly and grab a few more blocks because I'm not going to go far with 14 dirt blocks. So let me do that quickly. And there we go. There we have it. I should have probably bought some cobblestone, but YOLO, we don't need cobblestone. Oh, well, I hope we don't. <laughs> I hope there's no glass that's going to just shoot at our portal. Oh. Oh, no. Okay, no, we have a uh, crimson forest, I think it's called. But I hate this place so much. The, uh, what is it called, this biome? Oh, I forgot what it was called. Um, alright, let's uh, look around here. Hopefully we can find, like, a normal biome pretty close by. Well, we do have the crimson one, which is good. So we can get a bunch of ender pearls from there pretty easily. But anything else around here? Alright, not that way. We're not going that way. Oh, actually, it looks like there might be some normal never wastes over there. So that's good. All right, well, let's go check out the Crimson Forest quickly. Hopefully, we don't die. That is the biggest uh, worry right now. I really don't want to die. Uh, actually, I think I might go home quickly and grab a few more blocks because I'm not going to go far with 14 dirt blocks. So let me do that quickly.
All right, so we can actually trade here. I think this is like a little tiny bit of never waste. There we go. Let's jump down quickly. Hey, buddy. Can you not see me? Do you want some of my nice gold here? There we go. Wait, uh, do I need to use a pickaxe on this? Oh, I do. There we go. Toss that in there. Oh! Oh! That hurt! He scared me, so I punched him out of the way. Oh, that really did scare me. Oh, look, a strider. <laughs> oh, that scared me so much. <laughs> Go on, come back here. Uh, trade, trade, trade. Oh, are you... Are you... Oh, okay, you're not angry at me. I thought he was angry at me for a second. <laughs> I don't trust this guy. I already don't. Alright, at least it's a trap now. Alright, so I'm going to do a bit of trading. Hopefully we can get a bunch of good stuff. I wish there was a second one though. It would have been a lot easier. Oh, oh there you go. Look, what a start. Look at that, guys. Ender pearl straight away. That is awesome. Oh my goodness, I was not paying attention. I was just like AFK. And this guy came out. No, oh, there's a buddy. Oh, I'm just a bit worried yet. Alright, need to eat quickly. Come on, go away. Go away. There you go. And you. There you go. And that one. Ah, oh, go away. Leave me alone. This is why I hate spawning in that biome over there. Because of these guys. They're just everywhere. Alright, we've got everything. Uh, we've got seven in the pearls. That's pretty much it. That's <laughs> not the best stuff. Oh, we did have some more gold left. Whoops. That is my bad. Alright, let's try to see if we can find a nether fortress. I don't want to go too far, though. Hopefully, we don't get lost. Okay, so we've got a crimson forest as well. Okay, uh, wait, no, this is the warped forest, isn't it? Wait, what is it called? Oh, okay, yeah, this is the warped forest. That is the crimson forest. That's it. Okay, I've got it right in the end, I think. <laughs> um, anything around here? Doesn't look like it. This is not looking the best. Oh, I hate looking for never fortresses. I'm never lucky with them. That was a weird sound. I just made a uh, fungus on the stick. So I'm hoping we can find a strider that has a saddle on them. I think you can find some with sh uh, with saddles. I'm not too sure. I'm hoping we can. Uh, any strider nearby? Okay, just some more magma cube guys here. There's one down there, but he doesn't have a saddle. Anything else? Nope, doesn't look like it. Alright, dang it. My plan is not going to work. Uh, maybe maybe if we go on this side, there might be one. Let's go check on this side quickly. Oh, okay, look. There is some uh, Never Waste server here, which is good. Oh, I say over here. They're miles away. Wait, do Striders actually even spawn with um, saddles on them? That makes me laugh when you have the baby on top. It looks kind of cute. Um, I don't see anything. Alright, I don't know how we're going to get over to there, though. That is the big question. Hmm. Yeah, there, it doesn't look like any of the Striders have saddles. I thought some of them did spawn with them. That sucks. So, oh, that's a bit annoying, actually. I really wanted to go on a Strider. Alright, we need to get across. Uh, from here, maybe? Okay, here comes the gas fight. Okay, car shoot. Okay, you don't want to shoot at me? That's cool, that's cool. No problem, it's a friendly gas, guys. Friendly glass. Glass. <laughs> friendly gas, I hope. Don't shoot me all of a sudden. Oh, that one's probably not friendly, though. I can't find anything, guys. I've been running around for a while now. This That was the Crimson Forest I was in. I might s Where's my bridge? I made a bridge to get across. Can we not see it? Oh, I guess we can't even see it. It's not even rendering in. That's how far we are. Is it up there? Oh, we literally cannot see it. Okay. Well, unfortunately, I can't seem to find anything. I am struggling a lot here. Hmm. I don't know really which way to go either, because now it's gone back into this biome. Okay, uh, I guess we can build across here quickly. There we go. Climb up here. Hopefully, we might be able to see something pretty soon. Oh, that was so scary. I thought, I don't know, for some reason they aggroed on me. Oh, and we got the achievement. 
really wanted the bow, that's what I wanted. Alright, well, yeah, it looks like we're gonna head home for now. Uh, we did go into the Never, I guess, at least. But I cannot seem to find anything. I've been traveling for a while. I think we might have to just dig in one direction again. It is very sad that I am struggling so bad to get this. Um, let me grab some soul sand, though, just in case we want to make a water elevator. There we go. All right. Perfect. All right, well, let's try to head home and uh, not die, hopefully. Uh, where is my way home? Somewhere this direction. All right, so we're going to have to keep running in this direction again to get back home. Home is all the way over there somewhere. All right, there we go. We are home, finally. It took me a bit of a bit of a while to get back home because I couldn't find the portal. But uh, it was all hidden inside the uh, that horrible biome. The, what is it? I forgot the name of that biome again. Uh, let's go to sleep though quickly. Wait, what is that? Oh, it's a skeleton with a shiny helmet. <laughs> Let me go to sleep quickly and then we're going to get some stuff crafted up so that we can uh, actually do some enchanting because we've got 35 levels now after that little trip. Oh, and we did also get 11, em uh, not emeralds, 11 ender pearls in the end, so that was very good. All right, so I'm going to AFK a little bit so that we can try to get some more sugar cane because it hasn't grown like we was in the nether. So, yeah, hopefully we can get some sugar cane going pretty soon because I really do want to do some enchants because this is a brand new pickaxe as well, so that is awesome. Oh, actually, what we can do, though, is quickly go and craft up a um, enchanting table and we go place it in our new enchanting room. Actually, guys, before we AFK, what I thought we could do is go and check out that cave that we found in, like, episode one, I think. See if there's any new axolotls that have spawned. We never know. Maybe we might get the really rare blue one. I think that would be really cool. Or is it blue, purple? I, I, I keep forgetting what color it is. I've never really seen it yet, so hopefully we will be able to get one of those at one point. I think that would be really cool. But they're meant to be extremely rare. So, anyway, let's go check up here. I think it's this way. I'm not too sure. I'm hoping it is. Oh, so we've got a brown axolotl here. Oh, another pink one and a lot of glow squid. There's a lot of axolotls in here. I'm really happy that we have this little uh, axolotl spawn very close by. Let me grab that. There we go. Get some air as well. Oh, and our bed is still here. <laughs> it hasn't moved. Nobody's stolen it. Do you know what? We might as well grab a friend for Squishy Joe. Come here, you. There we go. All right. All right, let's go put this guy with Squishy Joe. I, I've never actually had a brown axolotl in this game yet, so this is a new one. Yeah, and I might just go and run around the world to try to find some more sugar cane. And if I do find anything cool as well on the way, I'll make sure to get back to you guys and uh, show you what I found. Alright, so I've got a bunch of sugar cane now. Hopefully this will be enough. I'm hoping it will be. I've uh, got a few leather here. There we go. That's 14 books. I do have some more leather somewhere. There we go. Did I grab it? Yes, I did. Okay, perfect. So place that there, that there, there we go. There we go, so we've got 32 books, that should be enough, I'm hoping anyway. Uh, grab some planks, let's grab some oak, because we've got plenty of oak. There we go. Okay, how many bookshelves are we going to get? Ten? Uh, we're going to be very close, I think that might be enough actually. Did I? Oh yeah, I did place one already over there. Alright, let's go over there quickly. Oh, actually, let's just grab our lapis whilst we're here. There we go. We don't have a lot of lapis, actually. We need to go mining again soon, probably. Try to get some more lapis. Hopefully, we can get a fortune pickaxe pretty soon. But yeah, let's hope we can get level 30. I'm hoping we can. Yeah, we should be able to. Alright, so place that there. Let me get rid of all of these. There we go. Place this one here. There we go. And I'm going to have to place one in the corner here. I don't want Waffle to escape, though. Let me um, actually swap this out for my shield. There we go. All right, we're good. There we go. One, two, and one there. What we got? That cannot be enchanted. Level 28. Ah, we're almost there. Almost there. Probably, like, one more. So I'll break this one here and this one. But, um, yeah, all right, we're going to have to wait a little bit longer to try to get enough sugar cane. I can go check in all my chests, but I don't think we have any more. Um, oh, I need to break that as well. I was using that last episode to actually look at our build. Has it grown yet? A little bit. All right, let me go grab these few little pieces down there. Yeah, we only need one book as well, so we should be able to do this. All right, I have the last bookshelf crafted, I'm hoping anyway. Okay, level 30. Before this, we had Fortune 2, so... Please. Oh, okay, that is awesome. What a great first enchant. Oh my goodness, that is perfect. Look at that. 
Fortune 3, I'm breaking 3, and Efficiency 4. What a great start. Okay, I'm actually going to go craft up some more tools. Oh, I don't want to research that, or not research, <laughs> enchant that. So I've got to place that there, actually. We'll have one more bookshelf there just for decoration and probably like a barrel there for storage. So, yeah, let me go craft up some more tools. I might do a sword and a uh, axe as well. Hopefully we can get a good enchantment on one of those. Okay, so what can we get on the sword? Looting 2. Oh, that's annoying. I wish we'd have got looting 3. And I'm breaking free. I think I might just go for an axe. Hopefully it's efficiency as well. Alright, perfect. That is really good. And for this, it will be knockback. No thank you. Um, I might actually go for some diamond boots though. There we go. Okay, anything else? Fire protection. Oh, no thank you. Alright, well, uh, that'll do it for today, I think. That is uh, enough enchanting. But yeah, I'm pretty pleased with that. We got very good enchant, so... A fortune free and efficiency four, and I'm breaking free pickaxe. That is awesome, and also a good axe. I'm breaking free and efficiency. That's pretty much all I wanted. I didn't really care about fortune. I guess it would have been good if we had a silk touch instead, but um, I'm still pretty pleased with that. All right, so uh, that's going to be it for this episode. I hope you guys did enjoy it. If you did, don't forget to leave a comment, a like, and subscribe. And I'll be seeing you in the next episode. Peace.